waiting for the race to start. Jeez, all these little go karts faster than me. Hmm. Okay, a Porsche. We got a Civic. Another Civic. The go kart. F forty. Whatever that is. <laughs> this this go karts is all I'm calling them. Right, let's adjust my fuel here. Because my fuel was way up there. Right, that should help. And now we're ready to race. So this F40 is on stock tires, and they did a 205. Okay. Yeah, F40 was another car I was thinking of, but I wanted to be classy in the Jag. Right, here we are. Race day. A little nervous. There were go-karts ahead of me. But I am the Grand Touring Simulation Racing Specialist. What? Let me stop. Shh, don't worry about it. Here we are, live on Top Gear. And look at those headlights. Let's show them the power of the Jag XJ220. Bro, why are you in front of me? Yeah. This moron pulled right there so I would rub his tire and ruin him. Come on. You can't block a gigantic vehicle with your toy car. But yeah, 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 Sakai? <laughs> What? What? Yeah. I'm trying to win a race here. I'm trying to win a race here. Don't don't dis don't disrespect the <clears throat> Grand Tour. Oh shut up. Yeah. <laughs> Oops! Someone else went off the course. Please be careful coming back on. Of course, you caused an incident with the Mustang behind me. There's a lot of action going on, and I'm doing a lot of passing. Okay. I can compete racing with this XJ. Such a large vehicle, it's hard to take out. And unlike the Charger Daytona, which whenever I drive that, everyone just destroys me. Get thrown around like a paperweight. XJ, let's show them your acceleration. There you go. Nice and smooth. It's a good jack. Very nice. I didn't have the best accelerating line there. I was the slowest to accelerate. How are people crashing on the back end straight is beyond me. Bro, it's all off the course. How did they even come back on and... That's completely weird. Well, we got a whole wreck. We got a whole wreck of three cars. Good job. This is supposed to be the cleaner lobbies. I've seen cleaner racing on Need for Speed Underground 2 on the original Xbox. Comes the F430. That thing is clearly outmaneuvering me. So it seems. Is there a 
understeer there from the Jag. The vehicle beside me sounds like it has a Viper engine. Literally. Hmm. Okay, well that's interesting. I'm very content with my position right now on this XJ. Ferrari went off. I'll pass you up there. Thank you kindly. Seems like everyone's making little careless mistakes. Meanwhile, I'm coasting in the sixth position here. Ooh, it's about the rain. Things are about to get a little interesting. Sakai, can a Jaguar XJ220 grip and rain well? We're about to find out. Yeah. Uh -huh. Good luck. You just said good luck? Alright. I'm not thinking about those little go-karts to be struggling with their small wheelbase to even stay with traction. Actually, this car feels better in the rain. With my little bit of tuning. This is about to be fantastic. I can turn better than the go-kart in front of me. Oh, this is fantastic. The tides have turned. Knew that or they're afraid to accelerate. Having a heavyweight like the XJ220 out here really makes a great difference keeping the grip down on the rain. But this lightweight Civic is now messing up severely. Oh, yes, this Jag, she is moving now. You guys can't see my face. I am smiling highly. But that Ferrari that messed up caught up out of nowhere. Oh, well, it's interesting. He has one hell of a tune. But the road is fully wet. And I am in fifth place. And it is. The track is soaked right now. This rain is coming down. But my confidence is building. The weight of this XJ220 is perfect for this rain. We have one more lap to go. And the top two, first, second, and third place are right in front of me. And this was just a test drive. I'm five seconds slower than at least eight cars in this room. But the rain has turned the tide, ladies and gentlemen. Talk about a hell of an outtake here. I'm not even mad at that. If I play my cards right, I'll pass this uh, little go-kart in front of me and be on the podium with an XJ on the first uh, test. That's crazy. So I'm going to be the uh, smart individual here and just bully them. Bully them until they make a mistake. Until I can find a clear opening. We're both losing grip. Come on, Jack. You can go better. You can do it. But show them it's your supercar that's still one of the best. That still should be feared. Let's get you that podium finish.
In theory, if I just stay close enough behind this one, I'm in third place, they have a higher penalty than me. But my ego screams for me to pass them in this dogfight we're having as we're approaching the last straight. Here we are. This is everything right here. I clearly was about to pass them on the straight, but since the time penalty to where it was, I have placed third place, podium finish, in the XJ220. My name is Mr. Yash, and welcome to the Grand Tour. <laughs> <laughs> Out of 18 people racing, this gigantic boat just got third place. Off of two tune test runs. That was it. And I'm five seconds slower than eight people in here. Third place. Thank you for raining. I wanna thank you for raining. Bro, when I when I tell y'all, that rain literally just gave me the heat biggest advantage. There's nothing else that can be say. Like this that's all this car needed was just its weight, its mid-engine weight, to just push down on that on that water, and just go. That was it. I am making happy face smiles right now. It's almost over. Nicely done. P three. P three. I just want to see myself up there. There we are. Look at that XJ two twenty just up there for no reason. No fours arrow, third place, that is all.